Last tournament, wins was something else. You know, he was a lot more projectiles. He was going for more down tilts, mix-ups, up, mix ups, you know. like uh, So he didn't see a lot of that today, which definitely surprised me. Yeah. But, uh, he here, still played really, are. really well. It's just it's a tough, it's tough, it's a tough field out here, man. But here we go. It is time. The showdown. <laughs> the AGN showdown, dude. This is now imagine this. Pika Pika takes out Sam. This is a loser's final. Right? I never get to see these guys play. Oh yeah. Yep. Uh yeah, it's crazy, man. I, I this is losers finals. This is, this is it. Whoever wins this goes and face off. Against the I modders and man, I mean Pika Pika's got plot armor right now. Let's just oh, be yeah. real, dude. This is if, if somebody's gonna come back, bro, and just absolutely dominate. I, I mean, this is such a treat. Who gets to watch Team AGN go at it? You know, and they may not be in grands, but I felt like this was gonna happen today. Like I really did. Yeah, look at and there we go. Soul. Look at Pika starts off with the oh, up smash. Oh man. Oh my Pika, lord. Pika, you know, and here's some lore. Here's some AGN lore. He said he was gonna come and take a champion away from Sin. Uh, you know, it's it's they definitely got you know they got years in experience, and you know again Pika is has unlocked something new today. Uh, but Sand looking to win this third tournament in a row. Yeah, we will Absolutely see. Absolutely crazy it here. Got quite. <laughs> it is going to be so tough, man. But it is such an uphill battle for both these two. I mean, more so for Pika. I mean, if Pika wins, it's a major upset. I mean, we're talking about 11th in Upstate facing off against first in Upstate right now. Oh yeah. So uh, this would be a huge upset. But it, I feel like today's the day, bro. I mean, I feel like if if it's going to happen, it's going to happen today. Okay, so it, you know, even the chat saying that Pika has been up to something, uh, you know, and maybe it is the Lost Ark. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he's been just been playing so good today, and it, clearly that work has been, you know, the labbing that he's been putting in, apparently, has obviously been paying off here today. I mean, I, I, if Pika has been, he's playing like the way that Pika has been, uh, I mean, we could be seeing a lot more uh, Pika in, in, in deep top eight, for sure. Oh, yeah, and, you know, here, 2-2. Two, two such an even game it's it's actually crazy all right pika coming up like such a great tournament for him today sand somehow losing the monitors there beautiful I mean, backer catch there and sand take control okay sand stock ahead pika only with the fury here up air, into forward air, into the back air, trying to find something from San San. Remembering all the good times where they constantly have played this game. <laughs> yeah, right. Good lord. Like, oh wait, I know who I'm playing. Yep. All right. But, good shield there by San. Always ready for those back airs. But man, Pika's just so quick. Runs into a nair though. Nice down air coming out. Hold on, that stage control. And they're going to the up air and San taking game number one. All right. Very, very. <laughs> Bless you. Thank you. Um, no, like, you know, even, even still at the beginning of that match, uh, Pika really held on there. And definitely a different approach towards San. Now, you know, again, they've been competing for years. San has a pretty decent record against uh Pika Pika, but yeah. the thing is, this is a different Pika Pika today. Uh, Truly, I mean, yeah, absolutely true. I mean, it, man, I just, I'm, 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 I'm like speechless how good he's been doing today. Like, it's, it's really, it's really nice to see because obviously we all know Pika Pika has the skill to be here, but to actually like see it, like in front of you, oh, is, yeah. is like it's so dope because you know the guy deserves to be where he is right now. You know, he's playing as long as he has, the skill, the amount of hours, the work. That he's put in and it to pay off and get you know as far as it is right now at, at you know ultimate of 23 is just it, it, it's a it's a breath of fresh air oh for you sure you know as, as much as my prediction is wrong now uh it's nice to see it's nice to see and here we have i modder sitting in the throne waiting for his opponent uh here at losers finals agn duking it out here uh goes for the up air now it's San is really just trying to play like his normal game, trying to get Pika Pika into those habits that he knows. Um, but Pika really trying to change. It, it seems like uh, we, we got a different game plan coming out uh, against Sand here. Yeah. 
there coming out for 27. The juggles coming out. Pika gonna roll right into it. He's gonna continue more. But finds a backer out of it though. It's a nice little window and an F smash there. Catching sand going up high. Okay, then we sand just fishing for these uh these nares. Pika just trying to get in on sand, but sand is uh, definitely keeping these hitboxes out, keeping the pressure on Pika Pika. 40% Pika looking to get this stock off of Sand, but Sand holding onto the stock, playing it very safe, but you know, always a dangerous character. Uh, no matter what percent, because it, all it takes is three hits and you're you're gone. You know? yeah. Especially with a character like Pikachu, man. Gotta be very, very careful. Goes for the back throw. Yep. Sand really just trying to uh, stay alive here, but Pika just can't find an opening against Sand here. Very tough matchup for Pikachu here. Uh, goes for the dash tech, gets that stock off at the lucky sevens. Yep, that was nice, yep. Just like that, with a chance here, uh, you know, Pika can start rolling through here, you know, maybe get some cheese going. Early stock, perhaps, would be nice. Here we go, okay, back here starting back out. Let's go, let's do it, let's get to it. Yep, Pika, Pika finding those openings. Mm -hmm. Oh, a little too high there. Try going for the neutral B, but San knows, man. I mean, again, these, these guys have been playing for each other for, for years and years since Brawl. I mean, there's not one thing they don't know about each other's gameplay. Oh, um, absolutely. So, I mean, and. I mean, Opika has been playing absolutely different today. I mean, let's just be real. Beautifully nice done. Dash tag is there. And now San sits with one stock uh, left on Pika. And uh, if that happens, uh, we could be going to just, uh, you know, an, an interesting situation where Pico may have to reverse 3-0 here. Oh, yeah. But it would just, it would be better for the story if it were to happen that way, you know? It, 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 the ultimate underdog clutch is totally possible. But here's the thing. I think what uh, Pika Pika really needs to do is get the stage picks right. You know, I mean... The best that you can do facing San, especially at such a uh, prominent like, you really need stage control. You need you need some freedom to like you know use the platform or something. FD, it's just such a tough matchup. Um, you know, being it's it's wild because you know uh, Ike is so slow, but it's like he really just makes his way around. Yeah, for what he what he doesn't have in speed, he just has like for range and I mean like just. Really, I mean, he, he he's a tricky character to move around with. I mean, people, you know, just think, oh, he just throws out this nair or whatever. But the way that sand microspaces, the like like the back end of nair, you know, he'll just catch you with the tail of it and he'll effortlessly string you oh, into yeah. a bunch of arrows. I mean, I mean, that's where he makes up for it. And here we go, the up throw is there. Uh, nice. As well from Pika and uh, Sand knew before it was over, he already was shaking his head, saying, "Yep, you got me. That's my stock." So. All right, well, Sand here, definitely understanding that Pika is not playing around here. Really trying to Ooh. win this tournament, it seems. Ooh. Back air, getting the damage off him. Goes for the Dunkaroonie, holy moly. Yeah, man, getting that percent on. Good parry coming out, Sand with the uppy, and there it goes, Pikachu. And that ether is so dangerous. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. So that will now be 2-0 to San here now. And um, ladies and gentlemen, it is now time. You see Neil meditating there. He's, he's, he has gone to a different place. Yes. He just opened Entering his eyes. Nirvana. He's a new person right now. That is not the same Neil we just saw two seconds ago. Oh, that yeah. Is, he, he actually changed, like, you know, like. He just switched the selects, wires like, over, bro. Yeah, oh, yeah. All right. Well, here we go. Let's see it. See, I mean, right now, Sand is, you know, he's feeling good. He's, he's ready with the with the, the map pick. He's, he's hes ready to go here. I mean, he's prepared for anything Pika Pika can throw at him. But Pika is going to make sure that uh, he gets his reverse 3-0 here regardless of how oh, ready yeah. Sand is. But here we go. Town and City. Um, an interesting pick here. We're going to see. Uh, you know, if this works out, obviously uh, he's avoiding the uh, up air shenanigans. He does not want to get hit by it, so, so it's a good pick. Oh, yes. Uh, but that means, you know, that that up throw kill won't uh, work either here. So Pika doesn't usually go for that anyway, but, you know, it's a nice tool to have. But I think it's a, I think it's a good uh, trade off for this one. Yeah, I mean, it's. Both of these characters' kids are so interesting. I mean, very mix up heavy, but <clears throat> at the same time, so true. Yep. Goes for the back air. 
uh, definitely putting some good damage on Sand is exactly what Pika needs. And then, you know, then you got the versatility of the stage with the platforms. Utilizing that, maybe Pika can squeak something out here. 93% or 91% Ike getting grabbed down throw in, into those nice, consistent, safe true counts. Yep. <laughs> but right now, going a little bit of down here, connecting onto San here. It's a nice snare. Just going to miss, but it was well, well placed. But, uh, you know, Pico was just ready for it. Fast fell right through and trying to get rid of the tilt. Just missing, though. He knew he was going to mid stage. 154%. San looking Ooh. to seal, but Ken, Pika just really keeping that, uh, this damage output. Uh, you know, Ken, it's totally possible. The ultimate underdog comeback. You know, game five situation, but, oh, San. That'd be the style to do it, but just like that, San turning things around real quick and saying, nope, you first, you lose that sock, and now San's gonna lose that one, so back to a tie. Uh, I mean, San definitely uh, would, I'd rather take a tie here than being down the Pika Pika any day. So um, it's very, very good that he was actually uh, able to keep that stock for that long. It was clean, but now he comes back here. It's here for Pika. Trying to close in the distance here. A little bit of some neutral bees, but they're going to be dancing around these platforms. San obviously looking for those nares here, but Pika knowing it. Trying to avoid as much as he can, uh, but eventually got to get close. But the super armor on that up B coming out strong there. and. Helping Stan get some extra percentage, but it's very tight between these two right now. They are going back and forth here, finding each other, tagging. Once at a time, Stan trying to find that backer doesn't get it though. 53 to 53. Yeah, it is so tight, dude. I mean, it, it is ridiculous how, how close these guys are. Ooh, trying to go for a little bit of that neutral B. Doesn't get it. Close. I like the idea. Gotta go very for nice it. Idea. <laughs> Right now, high side, he's standing trying to be there. Off smash, not going to work here for Neil. Escaping. Back onto that platform, which will be, but a back air there to get rid of it. Good parry, uppy on that shield. As of right now, here, a little bit of fair action. Coming again, 107. Trying to find the ledge, able to do so. It's a high side B up. Nice near to up air, but just able to escape. And a beautiful dash attack on the rebound. And just like that, dude. Getting some nares. Back and forth they go. Pika on the hunt. Downby not going to connect. Trying to find some more. Finding a back air onto that shield. This sand. Trying to close that distance. Trying to bait him out with a side B or something. But back air is going to land for 17. Fares connecting. Pika chasing. Down on that platform. Coming around. Beautiful conversion there. 37 catching Pika through the platform. This is Pika's last stock in this tournament right now. If he does not take San out here, he needs to do this. Oh my god. Trying to get in there. Not going to quite connect. Catches. Back air 58. Looking for some more. The grab to the up throw. Trying to find the up smash. And looking for the finisher, but doesn't get it as Pika gets right back to the stage here. Up here, Pika hanging out for dear life, man. But there's a back here, and it's gonna kill. And San Wild. will take it. GG's on that, dude. Oh my god, that was disgusting.